laughing because they know it's happened to them, and guys aren't laughing because they're horny. Look, you know that this shit happens. No girls ever like the guy that much. They're never like, oh baby, you're hard already. Let me see under the balls. Like, you don't do that shit. But we do. We eat ass, bro. You understand? There's guys out there licking buttholes, and that's just because it's 2021. You gotta eat ass, bro. It's crazy. What else are you gonna do? Everybody else is finding their like partner for life and then they're like spending all this money on an engagement ring, taking your fucking cute photos and then you break up two years later? Yeah, you wanna know why? Because it was the wrong ring, bro. This ring. Whatever I'm going licking where the girl fucking poops from. Eat her ass. That's real fucking love, bro. They're more beautiful. <laughs> Girls get to get creative when they send the news. They get to send like little packages where they're like, they do like the fog out of the mirror and they're like, oh, a little bit of titty, whoops. You know what I mean? Like, what? Picture number two, and they're like, all ass, no titty. Picture number three, little titty. Little, I like fucking charcuterie boards and nudes. You guys get to get crazy. Not us. Ask a guy for a nude and we're just like, okay. You know what I mean? We have two options. Two options. You ask a guy for a new two options. Option number one, dick pic, which is just like a mugshot of your dick. That's it. <laughs> or option number two, dick pic with your face in it. That's it. And even when you send a dick pic with your face in it, it has to be the same dick pic face every single time. You can't even get creative. It has to just be you with a boner and... <laughs> That's it. I can't be mouth closed like I'm taking a driver's license for real. I definitely can't be smiling. Like, it was me. It was me the whole time. It was my boner. Do you like it? I'm horny. I definitely can't be hands-free. Like, who took the photo? You know what I mean? Like, it's just me, just hard. Just beep, beep, beep. You know what up, Jessica? Like, that can't happen. So if there's anything that I can say, because there's a vibe, and I'm just trying to make sure that you guys have a good fucking Christmas party. And the first part about that... The first part about that is like, yo, make them laugh. The second part, we're in TED Talk territory. You know what I'm saying? If I can say anything, it's 2021, get a little bit dirtier. Lick our balls, like suck our balls. <laughs> See that answer? Yeah. Girls were like, why would I do that? And all these guys are like, preach, Reverend. You know what I mean? Like it's not even, suck our balls. We're the last generation that's gonna appreciate getting our balls sucked. We're the last generation that had to struggle to fucking jerk off. Do you understand? When I grew up, all I had was a fucking VHS tape that had a sex scene in it. You know what that's like? Jerking off the weekend at Bernie's 2 for three years in a row? It's not fun. But everybody in this room gets it. There's guys who are like, yo, this is too dirty for me, but fuck, I've jerked off to a catalog before. Like, they, these kids don't know that. These kids have fucking iPads now. You show them for now, they're like the horse team and spin on it. Like, I don't even know what the fuck these kids are watching. Dirty shit, sometimes your mom catches on. Why do you keep watching Titanic? Get out, get out of my room, mom. Suck our balls. It doesn't even feel good to get your balls sucked. You ever sit on your balls accidentally, going to check your email, and you're like, oh, that's cancer, for sure. Like, why the fuck did that hurt? The only reason why we like getting our balls sucked is because when a girl puts our balls in her mouth, something in her brain is like, oh my god, this dirty girl is sucking my butt. This is why you swipe right in Hamilton. This is fantastic. This is insane. You know? It's crazy. And girls always look at me like, you're not talking about me, though. And you're like, oh, I'm not? They're like, no, I'm a dirty girl. And you're like, yeah, okay. And they always give you the same 1994 answer. Why are you a dirty girl? Like, I have sex in the period. Let me tell you guys something. It's 2021. If you're not having sex in the period, you're not in love. Put a towel down. Run a red light. Give her the red carpet treatment. You're not a real knight until you've had a little bit of blood on your sword. You want to be dirty and have sex in the period? You better let me figure you before and put that on my tribal paint. Like motherfucking Simba's birthday. Too far. Too far. I get it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I know. I know. Now I feel misunderstood. That's not what I came here to do, but this is where you guys took me. I didn't know what I was going to talk about. But... Whoops. I'm not saying. I'm not saying now I got to fucking do apologies and shit. 
I'm not saying that if a girl sucks your balls on the first date that you make that your girlfriend. Let me make that very, very clear, okay? You make that your wife. If she's sucking balls on the first date, what's she doing after week two? Like an asshole, probably. What's she doing after a month dressing her pussy up like a dinosaur? You're just an asteroid. Make me extinct. God damn, Hamilton, you can't do it again. Merry Christmas.